fall is officially here. You can find, of course, the mums and the gourds and the pumpkins and everything pumpkin flavored. But one thing you'll have to wait for, the leaves. Fox 2 meteorologist Angela Huddy is live in Kirkwood with the leaf report. Angela. <laughs> Glenn, you gotta have your patience. Everyone wants that beautiful color. It will come in time for now out here at Powder, Val Powder Valley Nature Center. We are still very, very much on the green side, but those colors will be changing in the coming weeks and the Missouri Department of Conservation, well, they're gonna be tracking it for you. Shorter days and cooler temperatures. That's the recipe for leaves to change colors. The less daylight we have, it kind of starts to signal the trees to have a chemical reaction and stop making uh, chlorophyll, the green stuff that, it's what makes leaves green. So as they stop producing chlorophyll, it allows all the other compounds in the leaves to shine bright. And they could be, that's your reds, oranges, yellows. Leaves on trees and shrubs may turn at different times. Understory trees are some of the earliest to change. So like your dogwood, uh, sassafras would be one. Uh, some of the sumacs, those are the types of trees you see a lot along the roadsides. Um, redbud trees will start to turn a little, uh, it, you know, earlier. But the peak of fall color in Missouri is usually mid to late October, when maples, oaks, and hickories are all on full display. Colors change first in northern Missouri and then spread southward. To be sure you will see great colors when you drive, head to the Missouri Department of Conservation website. There you'll find a blog detailing changing colors in eight different Missouri regions. And we'll kind of give an update of, hey, head down Highway 94, the, the, the whole winery drive out to Augusta, or maybe up Highway 61, or head down south, down 55, and check out these spots, or we even throw in a few conservation areas and other sites of interest. Some of the best places to find gorgeous fall colors are along forested river bluffs or in older neighborhoods and cemeteries, but be wary of trees changing color too quickly. Some things like hickory and walnut, we'll see them turn early and sometimes lose their leaves before everything else even starts to turn color. That's typically a time you might want to call an arborist. Yeah, and also if your pin oaks have been yellow for uh, August and September, they shouldn't be that way. Maybe a fungus that's been going around. Now, the Illinois Department of Natural Resources, they also issue a fall color report. They just started updating that today. So we will link you to both of those fall color reports with this story at fox2now.com and on our Fox 2 mobile app. Out here in a very green still Kirkwood in fall, though, officially. I'm meteorologist Angela Huddy, Fox 2 News.